this is the third time <laughs> that I've tried to record this. The first time, uh, the phone was at a weird angle and, and you could see like this much of my face. <laughs> Whoops. And the second time, I just rambled for like 10 minutes about nothing. I wish I could, I could just spawn uh, rainbows. You just be like, look, it's a rainbow. Can't do that. I was not born with that superpower. Dang it. Did anyone else, when they were growing up, maybe you were uh, uh, reading comics or, or about the age of, of puberty going to start? I remember when I was between like 10 and 14, did you ever do this where you were just patiently waiting for your mutant powers to, to come around? Like maybe I saw X-Men at too young of an age or something and, and I definitely read those comics when I was a kid. Uh, the Dark Phoenix Saga, oh my gosh, so good. Uh, but I, I remember thinking that like, like puberty's gonna happen, I'm gonna get a major headache, and then I'm gonna have powers. I'm gonna turn 11, I'm gonna get my Harry Potter letter in the mail. <laughs> I'm sure some of you had that same expectation, that same kind of uh, weight in your life. How'd you deal with that disappointment? I don't really remember the disappointment as a kid. I remember being like 13 and thinking my brother will be 11 eventually. Maybe he'll get a letter. Letter. I, I, I don't know. Yeah, was I disappointed? Maybe, but I was way more disappointed about not having superpowers, about not being a mutant, than about not getting the Harry Potter letter. I'm not in Britain anyway. There's no magic schools over here. I remember when I was younger, I, I was thinking about like, what if they, what if they had an American character in Harry Potter? Like, why? Who would that character be? Maybe there's some fanfics out there. We'll see. Maybe she'll come out with another sequel, Magic in America. Who knows? I have no idea why I'm on this tangent. I just wanted to come by, say hello, wish you a good day. I need to go shave. I'm finishing the book today. And then it's just a, a short editing process. Get a cover drawn up. Get that thing published. I'm, I'm very excited about that. And I'm very excited for today. I fell asleep thinking, uh, dreaming, yeah, about the little Dungeons and Dragons figurines. I don't own any. I don't play D&D. &D. Nothing against it though. It looks awesome. Um, yeah, what a, a strange dream. I fell asleep thinking about those little figurines. And then woke up thinking about shading. I think I just mentioned that. Yeah, it, it's so annoying. My God, hats off to people who shave regularly. This is, there's little knives growing out of my face and it's painful. <laughs> <laughs> whining about shaving before we get too derailed and too far off of uh, any topics at all I don't, I don't know if this video really has a topic but don't want to go back into ranty form want to leave things a little more focused I'm trying to figure out what to do with this channel is it just a, a vlog channel am I just going to get on camera and, and just throw ideas at you I mean that's that's fun I like being a generalist in things. I, I like touching on many different subjects and, and for many different purposes. But, but you come here for a specific reason. You're not going to watch something that isn't entertaining to you. And that's good. That's human nature. That's I'm like that. So I'm really excited for this 30-day challenge because it, every day I'm going to have to come up with something new to put out. And that's the easy part. The difficult part is, is focusing that in. Like, what do you want the channel to focus on? And maybe it's, maybe it's, it is just a vlog channel. 
We'll see. We'll see. In the meantime, it's Tuesday. It's so exciting. We get to be alive again. Isn't that great? Ah, I woke up. It's good. I like feeling that way. I like feeling very grateful to to start my day. Also, I need to work on... Uh, is enunciation a word? On enunciating? On pronouncing my words better? I've been told multiple times that I have an accent. I'm from the Pacific Northwest. We... What? <laughs> Uh, some lady around Thanksgiving asked if I was from Australia. That makes no sense to me. Um, <laughs> some guy in the gym, yes, two days ago, he, whatever. He was like, where are you from? What's that accent? Washington State? <laughs> so, I'm probably mumbling. It would make sense. <laughs> So I need to work on that. If I'm mumbling in the videos, comment on it. Let me know. Get the marbles out of your mouth, Luke. Come on. That's a phrase, right? Marbles, mouth. How uncomfortable. How bad for your teeth. I mean, people like rock candy. I'm done. I'm done. Have a great day. I'm going to go finish this book. Thank you so much for your time. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. And if I may